So, which is why your development cost is so high, you see. Your development cost is so high because you need the vendors to build the stuff. And because if you need the vendors to build the stuff in the correct way, for example, so, so, so for example, like, uh, so what, before I use that word, which I'm trying to avoid using, but I have no chance but to use it. Um, so, for example, uh, one of the prevailing paradigms here is that of like a gallery wall, or like, of course, of course they won't call it a gallery wall now, right? Of course they will, they will dress up and say, oh, it's interactive because you can press buttons and do things and that, those kinds of... So, yes, there is some degree of interactivity, but actually the prevailing paradigm is that of just... Um, and on another word which is often overused in this way uh, is immersive, which, which my mentor, Nathaniel, oh. has... Oh, you want to say something? If you don't mind, uh, yeah. would you like me to try and explain this? Can, I, might, I think can, I have an illustration which might help. Yeah, you, yeah, please do. Which might help the people yeah. in this room. Yeah, uh, because I'm fucking cold. Yeah. Uh, yes. Uh, so let me give an example of what uh, Kenneth is talking about. When I was uh, studying in the States uh, a few years ago, what uh, a couple of my classmates, well, this is not to, this is not to uh, discount what they are doing because those are very bright people, but a couple, what a couple of my classmates did for their project was an educational application where you have this virtual uh, cell and you can, and essentially it's a 3D model of a cell and the, and the user can fly around inside this cell and move around and look at all the different uh, parts of the cell. In, uh, in, in miniature. And so they wanted to make a little game of it. And so what they did was that they hid the uh, little uh, coins around, the, uh, around this miniature, uh, around this blown up uh, to massive scale cell so that the, user, the, the students could move around inside the cell and do a little treasure hunt for the coins. So why this, so this also all sounds, this all sounds, quite attractive on paper, right? I mean, it's, it's 3D, it's immersive. You get to uh, look at it from all angles. And of course, uh, I suppose that in some ways, compared to a textbook, uh, there is a uh, minor improvement. But at the same time, looking at this virtual cell, just like looking at, uh, just like looking at uh, pictures of a cell in a textbook, don't really tell you anything about how the cell works how the different organelles interact with each other. The equilibrium, the chemical equilibrium inside the cell, none of this is even mentioned. All you know, all, all you do is to see, okay, this is the cell, this is part A of the cell, this is part B of the cell, this is part C of the cell, which you could learn just as well by looking at a diagram in a book. Is that uh, yeah, what yeah, you're yeah, trying to yeah, bring yeah, across, Kenneth? Yeah, thank you. Yeah. So, you want to talk about? I am no, 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 I refer to, I refer to him as, I refer to Nathaniel as my mentor. Because even though he has got no doctorate yet, something is missing Not here. Not trying to get one, thank you very much. <laughs> um, uh, um, yeah, I, I've, the, the, I've, I've learned more from Latina than I have learned from anybody, almost anybody. So, um, yeah, so Latina also used word, the textbook, right? And the, the other cliche, which the other cliche is of course it's much overused, is to make the textbook come alive. Why do we have these kinds of educational technology glorifications so that we can make the textbook come alive? And 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 related to that, related to that is the whole assumption that by making the textbook come alive, things will become more fun. And by becoming more fun, there's a direct link to learning. This whole thing is flawed and fraught with um, what in management terms is called jumping what jumping the ladder or what? I can't remember what. what it, there's something about ladders. And, okay, the meaning you are making too many uh, ladder of inference, correct? Ladder of inference. So you are inferring, you are, you are making too many assumptions and then you are like arriving at the wrong, you are arriving at a conclusion which is based on questionable uh, assumptions. So the word that I've been trying desperately to avoid, but I cannot, is that of an e-textbook. So if this is the e-textbook philosophy, then um, <clears throat> okay. So I'm trying to contrast it with the e-workbook philosophy. Now, what? What? Uh, sorry, pardon those of you who have heard this in of time. So what do we mean by the evil book philosophy? We mean by I mean by the evil or we mean by the evil book philosophy, uh, 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 an approach where the virtual environment 
is treated more as a canvas for in which the students, I'm purposely putting words on the board, uh, can express their evolving and naive preconceptions and misconceptions about the subject. Okay? So, every word I'm writing in this column is important. Uh. Okay? I'm treating the virtual environment as a canvas upon which the students can express their evolving and naive preconceptions and misconceptions about the subject so that it creates teachable moments for the alert teacher, which all of, you, all, of you, all of us here are, okay? So that it creates teachable moments as well as both from the point of view of the teacher, but very critically the point of view of the peer. And this is what this is where the true collaborative nature of the learning comes in. So, so, and, and, and this inherently is fun, although fun is not, this fun is not foregrounded, because it is, not because it is anything, but because it is safe. And why is it safe? Because they are, they are what our experience for Amokyo is that the, 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 the because the students know they are not, the, the students know they are not there yet, huh? the students know they are not there yet. But in a traditional classroom environment, they don't want to. They don't want to show that they're not there yet. They are scared of showing that they're not there yet because, because of the way a classroom is structured. In this kind of very formal uh, structure, literally a structure, uh, where you have rows and then you have a leader figure in front, who is obviously the leader, the, the authority figure. People will, yeah. Singapore yes. Asian students will not generally be. Uh, for coming to, to show that they are still evolving in terms of their conceptions. But if you have a if you have a canvas of virtual environment in which everybody is lit literally massa massa together, okay? I don't know how to spell massa massa, but when everybody is massa massa together, then it becomes a very safe and the, the fun is the fun is there but it's in the fun is the fun is secondary to the learning. Yeah? Mm. The learning is 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 in is is in all this magic, not in this kind of uh, okay. So so that's in terms of philosophy. And as a re um, related to that, the related to, to that since about two thousand for about four years or so, but but particularly in, in twenty ten and twenty eleven, I was um, <coughs> um I just have so I have to mention the six learnings now, right? I'm sorry. Um, uh, related to that. Uh, Oh, okay. No, without doing it. So, one of the problems that what? Okay, what, okay. So this is all fine and good, right? But then, teachers, even teachers from really good schools, uh, and teachers who, have, who, who, who who should really know better, uh, very difficult for them to understand this. Uh, no, 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 no. Uh, very difficult for them to 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 to, to have the time no, no, no. to realize to come to this realization for themselves. Very difficult for them to come to this realization for themselves because they don't have the time to reflect on their practice because we all know what it's like in, 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 in school. Okay? So this kind